Now Sorry. we're live. We are live from the World Series of Poker. Hello, San Diego. 2023 main event. And Nikki, I have to tell you, I just took my morning dump. Okay, thanks for telling me. And as I was walking out of the bathroom, John Raisner walked into the same stall. The at Right after? Yeah. Why'd you do him like that? He walked into a different stall. I just wanted the story to sound <laughs> cooler, but it just felt so cool. It felt you like you seemed you're in, cool for a second. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, it was unreal. Yeah, his he, his ass would have touched the same seat that your ass touched just moments. Speaking before. of asses touching seats, Toby Lewis in the house. <laughs> <laughs> his life has been changed forever now, Nikki. Yeah, I I agree. Well, is maybe forever is a long time, but no, forever. Okay. The internet is forever, right? Yeah, the internet is forever. Yeah. So last night, Toby Lewis uh, got into some trouble, but let's show you guys the chip leaders real quick from the main event, day six: Zachary Hall, Brian. Or Obregon, Liron Batito, Andrew Hulme. Sound like a bunch of philosophers or something. Like yeah, that. they should write books, all of them. Tony Dunst up there. Any notables, Producer John? Yep, and here are the notables. Uh, my bathroom buddy, Big John, yeah. Raisner. Ass buddies. <laughs> what was that game you guys played? Put it up your... Yeah, what's up my butt? It what's hasn't come a, yeah. out yet because I failed to edit it because I was playing the main event. Oops. Uh, Ryan Tosic, too sick online. Daniel Weinman, old school grinder, not on tilt. Nikita Luther. Yeah, let's go. Yep. Nate Silver, nasty Nate. Um, big rig on fumes now. Yeah. One yeah. Point, well, no, 1.65 million. I'm surprised. <laughs> is not he, enough gas to get him through a few hours. But I'm like, surprised he's alive. Uh, <laughs> the way. <laughs> the, the punts that I was watching and uh, the ones that got there, I was. It was really fun to watch. Let me let me be honest. I want him at final table. I really want to watch that over and over again. I could watch that all day. Um, I would also say I was playing the six hundred dollar ultra stack yesterday, and it was so fun watching the featured tables with a room full of people playing poker. I don't feel like you get to experience that often uh when the main event is happening like in the next room over and like you got a crowd of people just like in intensely focus on the game that was on screen yeah the energy yeah the energy in here is crazy that's the chip leader uh zach hall one 16 million i believe just an absurd amount of chips yeah the that's energy in here is crazy chips. we are going to start you off with some just preview coverage, just go around the tables, update you on some hands, some happenings, and then... This is we, like what it would feel like if you were here. Yes, uh, but you had to listen to us and to watch a camera <laughs> at the same time. Um, but we're here. That is the circle beard. This guy has a, a prop bet that he lost. You can't really see it, but he had to shave all of his hair except the beard part up to the top, so it created a circle around his face. <laughs> well, smart of him to wear a hat. But that... Th that got him a free roll in the main event. That's how he got oh. a 50, 50 free roll. From, Shit, I wish I yeah. could grow a, cir a circle There you see beard. it a little. Uh, it's like a Friar Tuck style. Um, yeah, thank you guys for being here. We're going we're gonna to start you off with a little uh, premature you-know-what. And then at one, you I watch this. I don't know what. What is that? A premature uh, preview. Oh, of, okay. Yes, Phew. Of the show. Um, and uh, then we'll get you into the main event on YouTube for an hour at one and then on Poker Go forever um what was the most insane hand from yesterday this one let's show you all right toby and for vampin we do have a decision closing the action is that bradley cooper on the rail like on the back end of a bender v visions of, of the four of diamonds ha has to be going through vampin's mind i uh i, I see it as well ali Cooper on a on a bender. Look at this, by the way. Upstairs we go as Vampin leaves. Of course, Rigby nowhere to go but fold. Toby, we would think, just goes for the call. Value hand in this line. It's interesting. Calls. This one's going to be interesting if both holdings are unimproved on the oh, river. It's really swollen. Heads up. Just south of 2.3. Yeah. Oh, and a board pairing five of hearts on the river. Let's see whether or not Lewis is going to be concerned about check. the prospects of a boat. He's going to proceed with some caution check. in the form of a check, although 
check raise is obviously available to him, provided that Vampin indulges. Eight high, no showdown whatsoever. Wow, he does oh. shove, Ali. Wow. How much is that? From I have a flush, you know that, right? King Jack of Hearts or something. It's the only fucking hand I beat. King Jack. Do you even call King Jack off? Probably not. King Jack suited. Why would you raise turn? You're not going to. Now it's starting to feel like he's he's going to get away, Ali, as you were saying. Well, the blender setting is liquefy. It's weird when it makes so little sense, it sort of feels like they have it in a weird way. It would just be an outrageous bluff. All right. Oh, oh it does my. get through for Woo! Vampen. And he shows it. Seven, eight, baby, let's fucking go. Oh, my God, you're insane. <laughs> <laughs> Just that was painful, painful to watch. And it was like, I'm glad you guys chopped it up, but because it was like a good five, six minutes of tanking. And everyone in the Paris, every single soul at the Paris was watching this. And when he folded, the booing that took place could be heard oh from the God. sphere. Go, let's show you guys the legend that is Vampin. I mean, this guy's straight out of Van Helsing. Yeah. It's sick. Uh, he was listening, and I don't know, some players aren't allowed to listen to headphones at the feature tables. What? Yeah. Baby Dick, Richard Wolf, who went deep in this tournament and deep in some other things in his life, <laughs> but... Not too deep if his name's Yeah, obviously, Baby that's, that's kind of the point. Okay, um, got it. He was complaining to me about not being able to use headphones. Hmm. Vamplin had Bose headphones, and during the coverage I was doing, whenever he took them off, you would just hear... Like techno, okay. In his in his headphones, and coming straight to his mic, and he was just sitting there. He got into it with someone at the table, and then he just bluffs the absolute shit out of Toby Lewis. I mean, my God. Whatever amps you up to make a bluff like that, I I mean, it's working. So not might have had some other uh, influences there, but uh, yeah, I mean, and people are saying, how does Toby fold? It's the main event. It's day six. I'm not going to judge someone for being nitty. Yeah, look, we're, we're not at the feature table. It's nice that we can see the cards. I understand all that. I, I guess for uh, my table was all talking about how if you were wrong, if you call in you're wrong, you still have 50 big blinds behind. Yeah, but that's the kicker, right? Yeah. It's like your, your hand's so good. And even if you call in you're wrong. Yeah, no one's going to fault you for that. You have the nut flush. And, yeah. then, and you have 50 big blinds behind. I mean, maybe if your tourna tournament life was that place. But again, he's sitting there. I'm over here. You are over here with me, with, and we talk this. a lot about range frequencies and such things, but some of these crushers, these live tournament crushers, like a Toby Lewis, eighth on the UK all-time money list, they play in 100%. So sometimes they might just think that there's no chance their opponent has a bluff. Hmm. Okay. You know what other hand was fucking nuts to watch? Like, everybody at the Paris was just eyeballs glued and, like, just every single street that came out, we were in it. And I don't know if producer John has a clip of this, but I'm sure you do. That Bill Klein hand. Oh with yeah, the Kings yeah. We got to show you this one, guys. This was Holy absolutely insane. Shit. Run the tape, producer John. You know, Pastor Buyer. Uh, no, I don't. Ooh, Kings against. Ace. Oh my goodness! All right, we'll get back to that. Yeah. Klein opened with Kings, and the Ace is now with the Space Consultant. See, Kara can bring good things to a table. Most people are afraid to talk to Kara because she's always talking to people who are eliminated. She talks about Taylor, and look what happens. And he's just going to slow play. Great squeeze bot for Ryan Brown here. A lot of money out there already. Really strong hand. Little does he know these players are really prepared to do battle with their holdings. Brown. Starting the hand oh. with 40. Oh, oh in. Oh, my gosh. The rip. Oh, my gosh. What does Klein do here? Oh, my gosh, Maria. This is. I've already let Mariotti fold. He just yeah. rips. I mean, I think Klein is just going to take his time and then reshove here. Oh, my goodness. What a pot. And this the space is consultant with the call ends up bringing in a lot more money. Klein with about 1.6, right? When Klein takes his 
time there that. There he goes. Yeah, he's just going to shove. And look at this. In. Oh, my. Klein can't love that. Uh, Rigby? Does Rigby want to gamble? <laughs> no, thank you. Oh. Well, three and a oh half million chips up for grabs. Aces versus kings versus ace queen. Call him for your one time. Wow. I don't know about using your one time when you're already ahead, but okay. Brown's really the one who needs to use his one time. He's in dire shape. Klein has them both covered, but only by about 400k. Get monster to deal with after this. What? <laughs> I think I folded the winner. A turn I had to of events. Oh, all the high, it's all high cards. Yeah, give me my cards back. I want to get in there and gamble with them. Oh, oh my God! God. Yeah. No. <laughs> A window for nice. Bill Klein. Wow. Oh. Wow, he's got the other two like covered, two players on the hook. Little. Klein just flopped a the set of kings. Too, so Taylor's kings definitely going to need to talk to a really philanthropist right. after this. Jeez. Oh, he should have never oh. talked to Kara. Uh -oh. never easy. Wow, look at this. A glimmer of hope now for Brown. <laughs> you see the outs up top. The tens for Brown and ace spades. Case ace for Taylor to stick around. Anything else and Bill Klein. Oh! oh my God! God. Oh. <laughs> that is oh, nice. A 10 oh on the end that for Brown good. to that's come that's through the wow. ace queen, burning the aces and the kings. That is disgusting. <laughs> oh, my Who? We got a player missing in action. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> this player has not showed up to day six yet. Th that's a good strat, actually. Wait, is that him? Oh, okay. No, he's here. He's here. I was going to say, because, you know, you don't bust if you don't show up. <laughs> this guy, uh, where's this guy been? What's he been doing? <laughs> what's, well, his, what's his pregame ritual looking like? What do you guys think? Probably getting a pastry. He was Let us know in chat. Yeah, what do you think he was getting a Danish? What do you guys think? Um, taking a seat. So we are going to be running you guys through the first level here. Things just getting started. You guys aren't going to miss a hand. Tune in live afterwards. Hands up. Cards, uh, cards down. You coverage. get an hour free. Wow, premium. look at and look at the champ. That is Sean Troja, PLO legend with the pink shirt, just eyeing up his prey. <laughs> Absolute savage. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for joining us today. Thank you, Nikki, for joining us today. You're welcome. Um, it's a great day out there. It is it's, day it's, six. What today? is it? Tuesday. Day, it's Wednesday. I think. Yeah, so Wednesday um, in here in the main event, day six, and it just keeps building. Yeah. You know, like a first week of dating someone before really or. Do you have any friends left in the mix? I wouldn't call them friends. No, okay. yes, no, no. I do it, Bucky. <laughs> okay. I got Bucky. Okay, yeah, cool. probably other people that are going to be mad when they see this. Charter, Christian Harder. Okay. We missed him on the Notables because he's kind of you know the forgotten man in not, poker. Not notable, no. unmemorable. No, oh man, <laughs> he's a great guy, even uh, better player. Rude. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I was out uh, till about three in the morning last night. Um, we were having beers with the Andrew Nimi made it pretty deep in the main. That was cool. I was really like rooting for him. He was uh, the hero that we all needed. Yeah, that sounds great. Uh, now I'm rooting for this Nikita. Is, yeah, showers, Andrew. Uh, this is Ryan Tosic, too sick online. One of the chip leaders. This guy's a crazy gambler. Wouldn't mind if he made a deep run. Um, but uh, I mean, what you is it? Chipotle? Chipotle? Yeah, <laughs> spicing it up, taking some chances. Let's go. <laughs> what do you guys think? Uh, what's the what's your breakfast go to in the chat? When you're sitting at the table, when you got to sit down and eat, you know, are you going Chipotle, McDonald's breakfast? Speaking of chances, what about that chance corn with bust out hand? How do you feel about that? Are you just trying to do like the hand segments? Listen, no, we got it. Like, we, no, 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 I no, get no, turned no. on we, by we gotta, okay, whoa, 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 crazy whoa, hands. We got a lot of viewers here. <laughs> Sorry. Let's go out to the field. We, we got to mix up the live coverage. No, I'm, I don't, I'm not trying to ask for you to play that. that I just would, wanted if, your opinion on yeah, it. Well, my opinion would be. Never mind. We, I don't want your opinion. It, my opinion would be if we played it, that would be a premature ejaculation. Okay, got it. So got let's it. go out to Christian Harder, the best player without a bracelet, potentially. And you see he's got his chips in that sort of cock and balls formation there. Um, how, how do you stack your chips? Like well, it depends on my, how many chips I have. Okay. If I have. If I have dust like that, yeah. I will often go cock and balls <laughs> to, to create an easy shoving opportunity um, into just the, the, the green felt. And it looks like Christian is doing that. Do you ever uh, make a castle? Yeah, no, when I have a lot of chips. Do you ever have a lot of chips? Not in a long time. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's been a really long time. Not um, many castles. How about you? Nah, I never didn't ever have a castle really. Are you like the female dust version of me? Is that what's going probably. on? Probably. Wow. I think we're probably uh, the same version of each other. Uh, in different different body bodies. parts. Yeah. So, 
So we got some players here. Um, what was your main bust out hand? Of what? Oh, of your the main. main. Oh, yeah. I, it was actually really tilting. I had ace king of clubs, some euro, three bet me small, and I just shoved and four bet shoved, and he had sevens. And it comes Ugh. 10, 8, 5 with two clubs. Oh. And then a club comes, but it's the fucking burn card. No. <laughs> so they put they it in. <laughs> <laughs> and it just comes like brick brick. That's so tilting. <laughs> yeah, it fucking sucked. Um, we're out of the main, but you guys are out of the main too if you're watching yeah, this. So. so stop judging us. Yeah. Excuse you. Well, pe speaking of which, Peter Kazakow says this is awful commentary. Peter. Bless you. Wherever you are in Russia or anywhere, I want you to do the hardest thing you've done in a long time. Go into your bathroom, bend over. And just slowly blow yourself. Um, but let's get you back out to the field. That is Daniel Weinman. Um, if you hate this commentary, one of the things that really hurts our feelings, and you can like let us know how much you hate it, is by smashing that like button. Like uh, smash the like button, hit subscribe, ring the bell. Exactly. DePaulo is gone, guys. Nikki is here, and that is Matthew Wantman. You get what you get. AKA it's day six of the main. Bucky, absolute savage, looking for a deep main event run. I saw him outside. On break, on day four at night, he had dust, 250k. So told me he was gonna win. He just said, "I'm gonna win." Oh. There's like a thousand players left. He's got absolute dust. Now he's got three million. You think but he's gonna win? Speaking of absolute, um, got Alec Torelli here. He was on my table day two of the ma of the main. Came in, uh, kind of like on the smaller side. Like I think he had like a starting stack, like 60k. Yeah, he and does. Then spun it up. To does like, come in on the smaller like, side. Yeah. Um, a lot. Uh, Nikki, uh, no luck in tournaments out here. Hey, I made day two of the 600 tomorrow. There, let's show you uh, Let's show you the Hawk. All right. The Hawk. Yeah. The all-time circuit ring winner uh, can often be shrouded in controversy, but uh, Chris Lee there, genius 28, uh, and this guy is an absolute legend. I make this joke with the Paulo, but this guy is a real living legend chris lee one of the best online players of all time just a winner nice i love the dodgers hat too yeah great hat game great uh, hat game broly on the arm uh and he is one of the few no sorry i shouldn't say one of the few but out of the 150 players left if i had to put my money on someone yeah it would not be maurice hawkins um <laughs> what's your ideal final table do you have any like Choi any, any top picks picked out? Oh, I mean, Maurice Hawkins would be absolutely at my ideal okay, final okay. table. Okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I'm picking? Yeah, yeah. Um, and and I, I shouldn't... He has a great chance. I mean, he's deep here. He's been deep so many times, uh, unlike Baby Dick. But uh, <laughs> who is that? Yeah, can we go... Can you... Sh let me zoom in on that. Is that... It's a big hand developing. Big hand developing, guys. We'll just... We don't know what's going on. Let's pretend we know. Pretend you're here with us. Mother Shipton says, Jesus, this commentary is bad. I'm out. We lost Mother Shipton. Oh, man. Can, can, do, do they notice hit the like button? Mother Shipton, can you just hit the like button? <laughs> yeah, on uh, your way out? On your way out, just if you don't mind. Bang it into the exit door. But we got Euro on Euro violence here. Neck scarf on Bose headphones. <laughs> deep in day six in the main event. Um, and yeah. Do you ever do the? Do you ever do the this thing to cover your toes? The, the no. I see I that a lot more now. Like I used to, I, I used to see it like once or twice. A, yeah, a the, tournament. The, the face now covering. Almost everybody does. Yeah. I guess because you're covering your men tend to have that like uh, when you're bluffing the like the pulsing neck. Yeah, this guy is not covering his face. This is Matt Kiefer. Uh, went to school with Sean Kemp. Okay. You know who Sean Kemp is? No, I just said okay. He's some type of uh, fighter pilot. Um, but oh, look, is that oh, is whoa. that Aaron Rodgers? The hat game. Tell me that's not Aaron <laughs> Rodgers. You just sit here and tell me that's not. You can tell me definitively that that's that not you Aaron Rodgers. That looks like Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> Let us know in chat, guys. One, if that's Aaron Rodgers. Two, if that's not Aaron Rodgers. Me and Aaron are fighting right now. Wow. You know, I'm a Packers owner. You, I'm a you, shareholder. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, and he left us for the Jets. I'm a so. Jets fan. Well, fuck you. Yeah. Uh, that is uh, the French bouncer, the European nightlife enforcer over there at the, the table as well. Um, wow, what a table draw there. No, keep that full screen. I want him to see the yeah, uh, French bouncer. You need to see the French it. bouncer. Uh, 
Clement Riche there. I can't believe there's only 150 people left. So we played on the final table today? Um, no. We got a few more days. Pace yourself here, Nikki. Right. I thought it went to day seven. Oh, maybe. Maybe we yeah, do. I, thought, I don't know. I thought I don't know. day seven um, was like But the day. there you have the French bouncer, the European nightlife enforcer. Also looks like a villain from like a Taken movie. Yeah. Like one of the early stage villains. It looks like an avatar where you get to switch out the shirt and the hat. like, And they kind of like went with two different genres. Yeah, I don't and really know what you're you talking about. But um, like Aaron Rodgers there with the Grateful Dead shirt. Are you a deadhead? <laughs> I'm a deadhead, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, look at this intense hand developing between Matt Kiefer in the Sonics jersey, and he's going to fold to the pressure of the French bouncer, and the French bouncer folded a full house in this thing. Holy shit. And This is excellent commentary. I yeah. don't know what people are talking about. Yeah, how could you? I mean, look at this. And and so in the chat, tell me that's not Aaron Rodgers. Just I'm telling you to your face right now. Yeah, but I'm not looking at you. Okay. That's not Aaron Rodgers. I'm looking at the chat. Um, let's show you guys what happened to Chance last night. It's time. Take a chance, and sometimes it works out, Nikki. Take a chance on me. <laughs> he doesn't get aces. He's not supposed to get aces. Raise. Yep. Just normal business. On the button, and look at this. Chance's big blind. What's Chance got? Oh, oh my Oh, ace king of hearts. Well, over 100 bigs deep. Here we go. Wow, feature table was not kind to Chance a couple years ago. Did he speak to Jeff today or something? Is that why this is happening? I don't know. He's always got a smile. He's never bringing bad mojo to the tables. But he feels he's got Rigby. Because he knows what Rigby plays. Wow, an ace is for the Stoic. Mm. Stoic is kind of a stirring, like, oh, what do I do? What do I do? And this is where having a reputation like Rigby and also someone with a reputation like Chance even, you know, is really going to benefit Rigby because, you know, he might fire off some real light four bets in a button versus big blind spot. All you in. also know. Did he say all in right Shucks. there? Call. Oh. All. It's just going to get it oh, out. Oh, my goodness. Chance Corneth, welcome to the table. He is the shorter of these two monster stacks. Oh That's my wild. God. Wow, Holy shit. Oh, just lucky. knowing. It's been like this the whole. His man there. Yeah, it's Rigby in line to it's shoot up the leaderboard oh once again with almost 6.3 million of his aces can hold. There's four bet shoving for 100 bigs. Gets action. Bullets. Chance Corneth can't believe it. His fate riding on hearts and Broadway. No hearts. Queen of hearts. Worse, worse flops than that one. Yeah, queen of hearts. Would one be heart nice. there. I'd love a sweat. Four diamonds. I already that's called greedy. the turn, That's getting greedy. Sir. So that's greedy. right. He called for it. Yeah, just so we're on All right, the same page. That's a rule. It's a rule. You can ask for it on the It's river. not really a rule. It's a guideline. Four Whoa. diamonds. I fucking called it. Let's oh. fucking go. And that's it. Yeah. Wow. That's wild. Chance. Corneth comes here with over 3 million chips and immediately hands them off to Big Rig. It's fucking wild. It's rigged. It's, live poker's rigged. <laughs> Rigby had a read on the deck, calls for the four of diamonds, gets it. It's in his name, Rigby. Showers Chance Corneth. The summer of Chance is over. That, you know, that shove, though, he gets paid because of the way he plays. Like, snap paid. Chance is just like, oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here's my, here's my, here's just my kind damage. Of, it's kind of amazing. Do you want any of this, by the way, or are you good? Yeah, I would love, oh my God, it looks so appetizing. <laughs> no? Okay. Um, that is Sam Stein, another legend. I spoke to Sam. Sam has a few kids. He's kind of like super rich, so he doesn't need to play poker anymore. Okay, but cool. he came out, and he's making a big run at this on the river there. Legend of the game, Sam Stein. Um. We do have two women left. Last two women standing, Nikki. Nikita Luther and Estelle Coué from uh, France. I, I did a lot of Estelle. I, I covered her uh, yesterday <laughs> on the final table. Uh, on the, the feature table. Feature table. Yeah. Um, but two women left in this. We'll get you some shots of them for sure. Sam Stein out there in the field. Absolute crusher. We still do have the cameraman who did the Blair Witch Project. I don't know if you knew that. Yeah, I can't believe you guys got him for this long. Yeah, That's we awesome. have him for the whole. No, we have him through the. Locked uh, in. 
until the final table starts. Maybe because of that, that writer's strike, you got you got him kind of That writer's strike really <laughs> yeah, turned really our production <laughs> around. I mean, before we only had producer John, but now we also have the cameraman from the Blair Witch Project. So we are rolling now. Going to give you guys some coverage. This is what we're doing. Just, just you know, teasing. I really want a lady at the final table. I know everyone says it, and it's like cliche at this point. But don't you think that would cause another moneymaker boom? Like, I really okay. feel that way. Totally. Um, let's get another lady. Two two women left out of the 149 players remaining. Yeah. Um, oh, there's an all-in here. Oh. Aaron Rodgers is out. Fake Aaron Rodgers is out. Two. Oh, how do we not get this hand? The French nightclub bouncer <laughs> takes out Aaron Rodgers. Look what you did. You know what? Me I and mean, Aaron are fighting anyway, so I'm kind of happy. He needs to get back to training camp anyway. Like, it's when yeah, does doesn't the season him. start soon? He's washed up now. Sam Stein in the tank here. Huge pot, Nikki. Absolutely massive hand here in the main Stop event. Stop turning me on. Uh, it's big <laughs> pan Juicy. alert. Wet um, pot. Uh, uh, Danish that I have eaten. Um, is sitting right here, and Sam Stein is in the in the blender. So yeah, we're gonna. Oh, and he makes the call. All right, let's go. Let's see what happens. Oh, and it looks like he's good. He's gonna drag a pot. Is he gonna drag a pot? He's gonna drag a big juicy, fucking pot. Oh, is that That's Sam Stein? So hot. The, yeah, let's go. Look how sexy that is. Let's go. Chich Ali asks Jaffe, "Are you a cola or Pepsi guy? Cola, obviously." Aren't they both cola? There's Pep Pepsi cola no, and Coca-Cola? No, no, no. It's Coke and, Coke and Pepsi. Uh, you East Coasters are just like, do you call it pop, too? Pepsi is ass. Get out of here. Um, Sam Stein, great pot. I do like cherry, wild cherry Pepsi, though. Oh, Dr. Pepper. I like cherries a lot. This is a cherry Danish, guys, in case you can't see. I'm just finishing up here. This is great content. What is, uh, what's what been your favorite moment so far of the series? Do you have, like, a fun... Do you have like a fun time, like a fun, a fun moment? Do you ever have fun? Yeah, when DePaulo uh, told me he was leaving yesterday, it was probably. Oh shit! Yeah, you were um, excited that I was gonna be on the show. No, I just was glad that uh, <laughs> that he left. Yeah, that he left. Um, no, we love DePaulo here. Did a great job hosting. Yeah, uh, shout out to DePaulo. He's so hunky, hunky. Yeah, speaking of hunky, hunky, this is Estelle Coe. Let's go. One of the last women standing. That's not Chris Moneymaker, is it? He's still in. Looks like a young Chris Moneymaker on her right. Maybe twenty years ago. Yeah, it does actually. Cola or Pepsi? Let us guys know in chat. Let's do a poll. One for cola, two for Pepsi. Yeah, um, exactly. Uh, it's called Coke. No, that's Coke is something else. Get over Nikki. yourself. Coke is something else. Uh, Estelle Coe from France. Team Winamax. A lot of great players. Ryan DePaulo's favorite uh, site. Yeah. Great inside the mind of the pro series. I think he has to say his favorite site's ACR. No, no. We spoke about it yesterday. He can oh. still... Show his love and appreciation for the French Winamax pros. Oh, okay, good. And the Spanish, Portuguese. We're getting a lot of polls in. Jesus, the chat is going crazy right now. The chat is going crazy. That what are is they saying there? Another legend. Cola? Another legend okay. of the game. Hunter Shit. Frey. Online legend. These are the guys I want to see. And there's someone at Hunter's table that is extremely annoying. Who? I'm not going to say. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I walked up, I walked up be, behind Hunter and I just said... Uh, I'll give you $1,000 if you bust this guy. And he was like, what? And I was like, seriously, yeah, I'll give you $1,000 because <laughs> this guy is so annoying. I do not want to, I do not want the world to have to see him. I've already dealt with him. He's I love the subtweeting here. Let's uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, we don't get to know, like we don't get to know who it is. Yeah. Big fan of Hunter Frey here. Brent loves him. Great golfer. Uh, old school crusher. Day six of the main. I mean, we are here at the horseshoe. We're going to go to YouTube for the Cards Up coverage, and then Poker Go is going to take us on out. I mean, the coverage has been amazing. Yeah, it Look, really has. Nick and Ali, always great, consistent. But me, Nikki. What? What about you? Me. What about you? On the coverage. Oh, I... It's just been incredible. kind of forgot um, you were there. Yeah, I, like, I really liked Maria Ho when she was talking. It's just been incredible. Me, Maria Ho, <laughs> Lon... Lon, yeah, yeah legend. big Lon, Le Lonnie legend. Let's go. Um, um, I, I gotta say, if you can't afford the main, 
it's worth it to come here and play one of the smaller like six hundred dollar events or like like yesterday just watching the main coverage live with a bunch of people in the room. You know how you go watch football with your friends and you drink and like it's way more fun than when you're watching it alone. It's like that, but I've never had that with poker, you know, like where there's a whole room of people just cheering and like going fucking nuts at hands. Definitely worth it to come out to Vegas if you ever get a chance. And you, if, you know, even if you can't be in the main. No, no, put the, it's just put the, the feeling. The, that, that always means, Producer John, sorry to interrupt you. It's okay. You know, we're... <laughs> You were not even no, like, that was, that was not great. like hosting a well, show here. Seriously, what you were saying was great. You know I just what? What, actually fuck off. Don't come here. There's what I people wanted, like this here. What I wanted to what I wanted producer John to do was was to put the shot on so while your speech was going, we yeah. could have a full screen of Maurice Hawkins. Yeah, but you're not being very subtle about it. You're just like interrupting my whole speech and they're trying to get people to come out here. Yeah, it's like a football it's like a football game, guys, except without yeah. all the fighting um and There's violence. fighting. It's just like really passive aggressive spats. <laughs> Poker players are so pa- passive aggressive. Egyptian, the online streamer there with the hat, taking a little yawn. He's not streaming anymore. He's making a deep run. Day six in the main. Big money looming for everyone. A lot of randoms in this field, Nikki. Did you get any cool pictures while you're playing poker? Wow. Someone in chat says Norman Chad. The, what's the thing they do to make me, you know, like the little thing like this? Norman Chad better than Will Jaffe? Oh, That's the, what it means? the greater yeah. than? The greater yeah. than? Oh, and look at this. Let's go. The circle beard. <laughs> Check it out. Check out the circle oh my beard. God, wow, that's amazing. We got the circle beard with the mincer. Okay, but part of his con- like the, part of the they should have worked it out where he can't wear a hat. You know, like if he's gonna get free yeah. roll for the main, like it should be part of the criteria. You know, I know. So this guy got a fifty fifty free roll just for shaving his head like that. But yeah. he's, how does he get to wear a hat? Yeah, exactly. And also, I think it's kind of like whatever. If you're a guy, your hair grows back so fast. Like if I had to do that. It would take forever to grow my hair back. Yeah. But hey, good for you, man. <laughs> so we're here. We, Looks like yeah, we got an all got? in. Jack's against Ace King. The classic flip. Jack's hold? All right. Jack's wrecked me yesterday. I'm so mad at them. Jack's tough hand. Uh, I got them back to back. They lost both times. Once, back to back. Yeah, yeah. back to back. Main event here, guys. Day six. This is the the warm up to the stream that's going to be start. Is that Yevgeny Temchenko? Jovial gent there. Guy looks like he's out of the Star Wars or something. Oh man. Got any cool stories you're going to tell your kids one day about about this main event series? Yeah, I'm going to tell my kids I did commentary on the main event. That's sick. One you think the, they'll be proud of you? They probably won't even know what it is. Are you going to let them be poker players? Yeah, of course. Does, do, are any of them no. expressing interest? No, never. Okay. Don't let your kids be poker players. <laughs> Don't let them end up like this. See, I think that's what, what happened is my, like, my parents are both in finance. Like, they're all like, in like, job jobs. Like, one's a CPA and like, one's a vice president of a bank. CPA? Yeah, and so I just like, went the opposite. Okay, we got a hand with, with Circle Beard. He's got a castle. Castle of chips. Yeah, Circle Beard is making a big run here. I think the Circle Beard is good luck. Yeah. For I would sure. do I'd pl- I'd do that would every day. Would you do the Circle Beard? If it got me a castle of chips like that and this deep in the main, yeah, I would think that that's the secret. I got a lot of like little luck charms and stuff. I got a lot of luck charms too. We haven't seen Rigby yet today. He's on a shorter stack. He's probably at the feature table. So we're about we're to about see the Jeff curse curse. Oh, oh the Jeff yeah. Black curse. Do that. That basically happened to me. Has it happened to you? No. Okay. But like he was going to come to my table and he texted me right as I was busting. The main wow. <laughs> Jeff is going to interview the chip <laughs> leader <Jeff> here. <laughs> wow. The Jeff curse. Je- everyone has. Have Jeff you seen has, the meme? Yeah. Everyone yeah. Jeff has interviewed has busted. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are seeing the curse live. Live. <laughs> so can Enjoy it. Interview the eventual winner, is that yeah. <laughs> Jeff is taking out every contestant one by one. This poor guy, Zachary Hall, chip leader now, but he's going to be out probably yeah, by you, the end of the you day. You should have paid Jeff a thousand dollars to interview that guy that you hate. <laughs> That's a good idea, actually. Yeah. Let's see if we can do that later. 
look at this. The Jeff Platt curse. Tells him to sit down. Enjoy the rest of your day. That guy has an absolute tower. Yeah. Oh, my God. Um, but, yeah, we're here. 2023 main event. 2023 main event. 2023 main event. The best main event, the biggest main event ever. So um, Rigby and Trainer are both on the feature table. Rigby and Trainer, who's sorry. is your trainer here? Yeah, or? he's my he's trainer making, is there. Your trainer's <laughs> making a deep run. <laughs> yeah, I'm rooting for. I got money on him. <laughs> okay, I don't want anyone to know who he is. Well, but, we but have just a new, know he's at the uh, feature I didn't know, table. Why don't you tell us that your trainer is making a deep run in this thing? Because he's at the feature <laughs> table. I'm not going to tell you who. <laughs> is Vampin your trainer? Is, is I'm that, not saying is, a is word. Is it one of these guys? Okay, so Maria's. You see Maria's trainer there. Uh, I'm with not the sunglasses. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I know I'm the fifth string host here, but <laughs> I have a name. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry, guys. Um, Nikki's trainer yeah, is in the Remco. field. Uh, Raisner and Rigby are on the feature table. That's why you don't see them. But, but they'll be back. Uh, and you guys will see them after this when the, when the final... When the, when the feature tables go on. Um, they made you commentator? It's <laughs> <That's> crazy. <laughs> so, I was just, you guys. I, uh, There's no budget here. Um, but yeah, we got a lot of legends left in this field. Wait, is that your trainer? I'm not saying. The, the guy in the Oreo shirt? I can't sell him out. No, he's at the feature table. Wow, feature table. Yeah. Stacking chips. That is a potential. You got me, you got me these guns. Oh, they can't see him. Yeah, they can. Ooh, day, day. Day six of the main event. Can you guys feel it? I feel it. Can you guys feel it in your bones? In my loins. All right. Let's try to be a little bit more appropriate. <laughs> all right. This is when we, look when we were doing dusty six hundred dollar deep stacks. <laughs> that type of language was fine. Damn. Oh, did, did you see my tweet? I, so I had the fucking craziest guy at my table. He'd be like super cool and mellow, and then he just spaz out. So he stacked a guy with pocket nines, and he goes. Niner, niner in the vagina. I'm so sorry I said that. Oh, I'm so sorry. Why did I say that? And he spazzed out at everyone. This is my favorite line. Uh, uh, let's go back out to the field, guys. Um, Who's the hood? Oh, yeah. We got uh, ha- yeah, the that's hawk. That's the hawk. The hawk, sorry. The hawk is about to yeah. strike. Chris Lee in a hand. Day six of the main event here, live at the horseshoe. 140 players left roughly now. 149. I mean, just a crazy tournament. Crazy turnout. Biggest field ever. Biggest first place ever. It's just going to wind down to a conclusion. And I mean, I have, like, do you have a pick at this point? It's obviously I not mean, the chip leader who Jeff no, just interviewed. Nikita is my pick. I actually think I manifested her by accident because her name's really similar to mine, like, it, when you see it on a screen. So, like, I thought it would be me to, like, you know, be the next. Like woman money maker boom, but I'm okay with it being her. That's my pick. Nikita Luther, yeah, she's at the feature table, so you guys are gonna get to see her as soon as we get out of here. Um, yeah, whenever we get out of your way. But before we get out of your way, like we won't get out of your way. You'll have to watch us forever if you don't hit that like button and subscribe. Yeah, I do believe Maria is gonna be with us for the next few days. Um, there's uh, Maurice the Hawk. Uh, all-time circuit ring winner. Feeling good. Got the uh, music cranking there. What do you think he's listening to? Maybe some, like, uh, German opera. Some Beethoven. Yeah, some, some Bach. Yeah. <laughs> Let us know in the chat. Are you guys Beethoven or Bach? One for Beethoven, uh, two for Bach. These are great polls. Yeah, we have the best polls here. The best chat. It's great polls. Just love and appreciation. As you see, the man who has just been cursed... Producer John. Yeah, that, that purple stack's about to disappear. Look at all those purples. Those lavender chips are worth... I never worth got a single lavender chip this whole series. Do you know how much those chips are worth, Maria? 100 k 100000 100000 100000 One chip. So that guy's got towers of them. Uh, it's going to be tough for him to bust. Jeff really uh, going out of his way to curse the, yeah. the chip leader. I don't put it past him, though. I bet on Jeff. <laughs> so these polls are crazy. Someone in chat says Beethoven sucks. <laughs> Beethoven's getting shit on? <laughs> that is Nikita Luther, uh, one of the last women standing. She's Let's over go. there at the feature. Uh, so you guys are going to see her on the YouTube coverage, on the um, Poker Go coverage after we get out of here. As uh, you see a little behind the scenes. 
Mincy is Mincy is on the loose. He's wandering around. Oh yeah, uh, we haven't heard from him. We'll show you his segment at the end. Let's show you guys uh, Makita Luther though. Um, is she from Paris? Uh, well, we're in the Paris, so it could have just been some like. No, Paris, we're in the horseshoe. Paris. Well, yeah, but it's always like Paris WSOP. We're in the horseshoe. Not stinky um, ass horseshoe. Do you know they like smoke in this? Is it so hard to not smoke in the hallway? Is it so hard? It's pretty hard. Okay. I, I actually like the, the area with all the smoke in it. Shut the fuck up. It just feels like you're getting like a, like a, the a buzz. Experience? You get a buzz when you smoke cigs. Um, I'm not saying anyone should do it. Oh, you can do it. Man. Just don't do it in the hallway. For Christ's sake. <laughs> Michael Santoro in chat says, Jaffe, lunch on the table just shows how dusty and lazy this guy is. <laughs> At least you have it on like a napkin or something. Also, first off, this isn't my lunch, okay? <laughs> this is my breakfast, and I like to get a Danish every day before we run the show. People want to know if they can buy high noon hats in the pop-up shop. Are you guys selling those, or are you just wearing them, teasing These people These high noon them? hats are in the Poker Go store. They're only about $65 a pop if you want to support the show. Can I have one? No. For free? No. Um, Every time I'm on here, I just try to get swag. Get some swag. <laughs> get some swag. All right, I'll take a purple sweatshirt. Um, oh, those, those make sure packages? you go out to the field if you want to do that, Producer John. Don't leave us on the camera for too long. Show these people what they came for. Yeah. You guys are going to get an hour preview right after our faces disappear, and then everything else is going to be on Poker Go. So make sure you head over there. But not yet. First, hit that like button. Answer a stupid poll in the chat about whether you like nachos or gummy bears better. I can't believe someone said <laughs> Beethoven sucks. <laughs> There's haters for everyone. Every, it's true. Just no matter everyone how good you are. Hater. Yeah, no matter how great you are, this you're still going to. He's been dead for centuries. <laughs> he's he's <laughs> one of the goats. <laughs> Who in chat thinks Beethoven sucks? Jesus. Jesus, chat. <laughs> chat needs to relax. <laughs> yeah, chat, come on, guys. You've been great for uh, three, four weeks. Yeah, take a microdose or something. Like, chill the fuck out. Let's get through this. Um, we got action here. I'm not sure what type of action. Yes, stay on well, that action, yeah, John. Yeah, we got a lot I mean, of action when, here. When I say action, when I say we got action, leave it on the hand. Okay, they're, about, they're, about the they're about to move the camera, guys, but... Uh, Beethoven the dog. <laughs> they think Beethoven I meant, the dog yeah, sucks. They, they think I meant Beethoven the dog. The dog's dead no. too, guys. That movie was like 30 years ago. Great movie, though. Great movie. Great series. Seriously? As a kid growing up. Didn't even know about Beethoven dogs. And by the way, we don't call them St. Bernard's anymore. They're called Beethoven dogs now. <laughs> <laughs> change the name. Change the course of history. Yeah, we were talking about Beethoven, the uh, musical composer. As you see this guy counting out his chips, going to put them in the middle. Going to see a turn. Look at all those chips. Turn is a four. Big pot here developing. You see a check. Wait, is that guy in the... That guy... Okay, so this is Nikki's trainer here in a huge pot. No, he's on the feature no, no, table. No, 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 no. We don't believe that. This is Nikki's trainer don't in a sell huge me out. pot here versus the guy in the white hat. Let's see what happens. Day six of the main event. Looking for a better life. Puts in a bunch of lavenders. So what pretty. is White Hat going to do? Tension is rising. <laughs> we got action here, guys. The lavenders are coming out. Those are greens. I don't think he has lavenders. Yeah, wow. Right. So this yeah. might be a... It's like a lot of his stack. Oof. Big spot here for it's White Hat. Size. You see the hands shaking. As... Nikki's trainer puts this guy in the blender. Yeah, he does that. Uh, and he folds, gets it through, and you see the persistence. Yeah, let's you see go. the hard work, all those sessions, all that physical exertion. Let's pays go, Greg. Off. Yes. Greg, Nikki's trainer with a huge pot there. Um, here on day six at the main event, we got about, I don't know, 10, 15 left. We're just going to hang out. Yeah, what do you guys want us to talk about? Something cool? I got a lot of trinkets. I met a lot of people on this uh, main event run. Um, I got uh, this. I got this summer booty blitz chip from Ebony Kenny. I think she's still doing that. If you find Ebony at any tournament, she gives you. And you have to say summer booty yeah, blitz. Yeah, I saw that. We had and Mincy. Shimmy. Mincy did the summer booty yeah, blitz. Yeah, yeah. And you get one percent of. I think it's one percent of her action for whatever she's playing that day. And you get this cool little, little chip. Shout out to Ebony. 
I got this wristband from a guy named Darius at my table. It's for the veterans. Okay, it's it says 22 a day because that's how many veterans we lose a day to uh, them ending their own lives. So there's this uh, project, and I got a bunch of wristbands. Go check that out to the tillvahalaproject.com. Check that out, guys, and check out. Chris Moneymaker Jr. over here. Look at this guy. Yeah, he really does look like that. The young Moneymaker. Like 20 wait. years, 20 years after Chris Moneymaker look at Mincy wins in the, the main. And you got, look at <laughs> Mincy getting a stretch in there, guys. Yeah. As Moneymaker Jr. drags a monster pot. Could this be the year that Chris Moneymaker's son wins <laughs> Money the Maker main? Moneymaker Jr.? 20 years later. 2023, 2020? Hey, I don't hate it. 2020 Vision? That looks way more like Moneymaker than the other guy looked like Aaron Rodgers. That guy does look like a young moneymaker. Um, and the other guy did look like Aaron Rodgers. No, he did not. And that's one of my buddies there. You can full screen on that guy. The Hawaiian shirt? Uh, no, I don't know that guy. I, I want to know that guy. He's taking Rob Kuhn's look. The Rob Kuhn but approach. But doing it much better than yeah, Rob. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, we got to figure out who this guy is. He's got a, his kid on the, his shirt? <laughs> oh, that's fun. Oh, wow. Oh, Look at his, that. Ca- his kids are on his shirt. That's cute. Assume that his kids. Wait, are we well, sure that's not Hezbollah? I got into trouble for this yesterday. I don't know. Okay. Um, and that is over in the blue hoodie, my buddy Alex. That's my trainer. Oh, that. sorry. That is Maria's trainer. <laughs> um, I don't, you can call me Maria Ho all day because oh, that sorry, is Nikki. A, that's an honor. Nikki. Nikki honor. Limo here with us. I hope she makes it to the Hall of Fame. Glad Nikki Limo could pull up on us today, make the show. Um, but yeah, we got about 10 minutes left. Yeah, I'm so sorry like, I'm sorry we didn't give you guys also more Nikita Luther big rig race in our coverage. We can't get over there when they're on the feature. So we're just showing you guys in what's in the field. The feature will be on in about 10 minutes following us. Yeah. So, uh, But you have to hit that like button. You got to subscribe or else you don't get to see anything. So it's like really a travesty if you don't do you that. Don't, you guys don't actually have to do that. Um, you have to do don't, that. Don't, don't, don't make it. So I like to lie to get what I want. Oh, people. man. All right. Let's go back out to the field. Um, is that Landon Tice? <laughs> Landon Tice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Why, th- how did the Notables miss this, guys? Landon <laughs> Tice making a deep run here. Wow. Where is this? On the, where's the coverage of this? Landon Tice. Day six of the main event, Nikki. <laughs> what is going know. on? Did, did this fall through the cracks with a decent stack? I, I guess so. Oh, my God. Nikki. Wow. <laughs> Solve for why. Let's go, Landon. Oh, Landon Tice, the young prince. The cat jammer the making cat jammer. a deep run here. He's on wow. my WSOP fantasy team. Oh, cannot believe this. Day six of the main event, guys. And that that is crazy. How does Poker News miss that? I don't know. What, what's going on here? Blair Witch Project guy got it. So yeah, that's well, that, that's how we got the best. But yeah, uh, shout out to Saul for Y, Berkey. The tortoise made a deep run. Yeah, he did. Obviously, I mean, he had, and a few, you know, he yeah. made a deep run in the Colossus, too. Uh, <laughs> that was pretty cool. Tortoise in the main. Yeah. Um, I think he ran deeper than anyone in Salt for Y. Oh, no, no. Oh, no? Oh, well, yeah. Not landed. Yeah, yeah, not landed. Yeah, he, wow, as we guys. just saw. As we just see. Crazy <laughs> stuff. Um, the tortoise made a deep run. That is Ludovic Geidek Ludo sitting down there. Uh, we got an all in here, though. Thank God you're the one pronouncing these names. <laughs> yeah, very good at the foreign accents. Ace King versus Kings. Ace King versus Kings. The guy standing up looks like he's, oh, he's showered. Wait, that's... Sorry, we finally found Nikki's trainer. Ah, shit, yeah. <laughs> Get showered by... Uh, who is that? Hey, GG. GG. See you at the gym. <laughs> See you at the gym, uh, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> and that's John Duffy. Wow, there are some legends left in the field. John Duffy at that table. Uh, old school poker stars. Just legend. I'm so pumped for this final table. I can't wait to see who makes it. It's going to be crazy. Final table in a few days. Let us know in chat, guys. Who do you want to see out of the field? Just just your favorite person that you could see at the final table. Tell, shout them out in chat. Who's still in or like no, who's in still an in. ideal? Who's okay, still okay. In. She, calm down. Calm down. Relax. This is high noon. Okay, true. Day six. You want me to calm down? <laughs> I don't know. You want me to just chill? No, you know, get, get spaz out again. I don't care. Oh, my God. We have to go soon. 
um, so that you can see. Who's that? No, no. Oh, hand. no. This is I know this guy. This is Juan. Juan Maceres. He was on the feature table the other day, just taking a soul. And look at the French bouncer. What do you think he's listening he, oh, to, oh, Nikki? Oh, yeah. He's listening to some deep techno music. Uns, uns. No, the flow is a little. Wow. Yeah, he's yeah. Drunk. Wow. The enforcer, the John Wick villain who dies very early in the movie. Just making he's a huge jamming. run here, yeah. <laughs> Who dies early in the movie? Yeah, like he's one of the early deaths, <laughs> but he, he he has a role. Should never touch that dog. Yeah. Wow. Um, just feeling the music, feeling the vibes. We got two more minutes, guys. It's your two-minute warning. Two-minute warning. And then we're going to show you uh, what Mincy's been up to, and then we're going to get you to. He's been the stretching a lot for we're whatever get you guys he's about to, the, to do. We're going to get you guys to the real coverage, but I do want to thank all of you for joining us for the fake coverage here. Yeah. Uh, it's been Produ a pleasure. Producer John only had a few technical difficulties today, so huge win for him. Huge win for Maurice Hawkins, the all-time winning circuit ring leader. Um, how many circuit rings do you have, Nikki? Um, currently or like in the past? Uh, now. Yeah, currently zero. But you have some in the past. No, I don't. Okay. Um, yeah, day six, guys. Main event. Check out Nikki and Caitlin on the Ace Holes podcast. Oh, yeah. We got a new episode dropping tomorrow. It was supposed to drop today, but um, I've just been slacking, guys. I've been playing tournaments and hosting High Noon, and, you know, a lot's been going on in my life. Uh, but it, it'll drop tomorrow. We got Marley Sprague. We're playing What's Up My Butt, and it's a good time. You'll never guess what's up anyone's butt. So, well, Speaking of what's up, what's up this guy's? Uh... <laughs> what's up his butt? Oh, so we'll be back, guys, the next few days. Uh, Thursday is tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow's Thursday. Thursday at noon. You got it. Friday at noon. Good job. Nikki will probably be joining us. It. Uh, well, I got to play a day two tomorrow. Oh, so maybe but she won't on, be. On we'll, Friday, maybe. She'll be joining us on Friday. Yeah. Um, well, it's a 10 a.m. restart, so I might be able to join you <laughs> by right. 12. Let's, uh, let's wait. Let's see this hand before we go. Yeah. Pocket got nines? Pocket nines. Ooh, I love pocket nines. Pocket nines. And A7 of clubs. I'm rooting pocket nines all the way. Let's go 100%. A7 of clubs. A7 of clubs. Show me a nine. Nine in the window, dealer. Oh, is that a nine? Is that a nine? Hell yeah. No, it's not. It's a 10. Damn it. <laughs> Doesn't we're still, matter. We're still holding. We're yeah, still holding. Still good. Hell nines hold. yeah. Nines hold, guys. Let us know who you want. I I'm going for the French bouncer. I'm going for Clement Riche. I'm going for Nikita. And uh, we're going to take you guys out of here to the. No, we're going to see one more all in, okay, Will? Is that okay with you? One more, guys. One more Danish. Thanks, Daddy. Um, Jeff Gasco in chat says, please retire from this. <laughs> 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 That's good. If you guys are going to just make it good. Yeah, but just, look, we just got, roast us. I don't we care. We got Sam Stein. Are we going to see it or are we going to Blair Witch it? Both. Yeah, sorry. Both. Wow. So you see Landon Tice. You see Sam Stein <laughs> in a big hand here. Um I don't know if Landon's in this hand. No, he's not. Okay, but he's Sam just he's is. looking at it. Big pop for Sam here. Can't see the hands. Which is what makes this commentary so great, is that we are trying to comment from a mile away from the, the table. Handless commentary. You try doing that. It's yeah. talent. It's skill. It's raw emotion. It's willpower. We got a lot of players from all over the world left in this tournament. Not just France, America, Europe. What country do you hope wins? Wow, and look at this. Sam Stein... The legend is dragging a massive pot. King Kobe himself. Two pairs. Two pairs. Seven and eights. Uh, might be chip leader now. Oh, shit. Better get Jeff over there. Build that castle. Build that castle, man. For the producers, for the people. Uh, for the in, people. Yeah, and in, in the people. Uh, for the common folk. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys so much. Now so much for being here. Are we going to see anything more? We're going to the John? woods. We're going to the woods. Can we send them out? There's a ritual. The Day five, first break of the main event, and we got the pleasure of being joined. I'm willing to go this far. A man that's becoming a main event specialist. Some would even say a main event legend, Mr. Rigby, known for playing the diaper, the 3-2 off in 2021 to get a lot of chips. He's kicking the shit out of the main again in 2023. How's it going? Uh, it's going well. Uh, I got off to a slow start today, but, I mean, it's just adapt and survive in this tournament, even if you have a short stack. I mean, you're feeling great. You're making a deep run in the main. Like, you're excited. Uh, I think I'm sitting on about 2.5 million right now, so 
down a million to start the day, but I mean, I'm still well above average. Today. Yeah, you got you got the right attitude. Like so many people in the main, when they lose chips, are like focused on what they used to have. But you just gotta flush it. It's such a long tournament. You know, you've been chipping up. I've been following you the whole main. You just been chipping up, crushing the whole main. I mean, this may be the first adversity you faced. Yeah, I mean, no one's gonna go wire to wire in the tournament at the top. But, you know, as fun as that would be. So. Uh, you know, as the days move on, you're not seeing those 500, 400 uh, big blinds in the tournament. I mean, so you're going to see those drop down like 200 bigs. Well, we got some snacks for you on the break. We got some beef jerky, whether you want some, uh, I guess it's called, we got ostrich, wild boar, camel. We got some prime rib chips. Let's try them, yeah. Do you want to do the camel? Camel. I'll let, okay, I'll let what him do the camel. What do you want me to do, the ostrich or the boar? I'll go, I'll go, I will go ostrich. We'll go ostrich. So this is camel meat. This is like beef jerky. I mean, it's just going to be taste like jerky. You know, we're getting an impromptu. How do you, how do you open these things? Uh, just, uh, we're getting a beef jerky review, Buffalo Bob's, with Rigby right on the break. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I got to say, this uh, ostrich tastes just, I mean, they hide it. It tastes like beef jerky. I don't know. It's pretty damn good. It's not too greasy. Uh... This was, I mean, I've had better beef jerky. A little tough. A little tough. You'd give it not a very, very high rating. Uh, I'd say like a 6.3. That's not terrible. I'd give this about 6.7. Yeah, I mean, edible. Anything edible to be hey, five or above. Edible, edible's good. I've seen some really wild hand histories out of you in the main, but I love it because you get value out of your hands. You over bet when you have it. People have no idea what you have. They don't know how to react. And like I said, you become a main event specialist. I, it, it, you got everybody on their toes. Yeah, I appreciate that. I mean, it's the biggest focal points I think of poker is you don't want anyone to know what you're holding. And it's a big, uh, you know, position and aggression game. And you can't study the charts, I think, and be successful in this large of a field. Like, you're going to have to. You have to get wild. Crushing the World Series main on day five. What could be better? Uh, you can follow Rigby on Twitter at GTO underscore diaper, yep. I believe. Yep. Uh, good luck with the two and a half million, and thanks for joining us and meeting with Nitsi. We're certainly going to be pulling for you and following you the whole way. Awesome. That was fun. Thanks. Thanks to Mr. Rigby.